Right now at 4.30, credit card companies could create lists of gun owners. That's the warning from Florida's new Agriculture Commissioner, Wilton Simpson. Today in Brevard County, he proposed legislation he says is necessary to keep that from happening. Western Scott Heidler walks us through the bill and why Democrats think it's more about politics than privacy. Calling it the Freedom to Buy Act, Commissioner Wilton Simpson chose the Lawmans and Shooters Supply Company in Titusville as the backdrop for his announcement Tuesday. It's legislation he says will counter what he calls a liberal push for reporting gun and ammunition sales. It's a liberal group that goes around and tries to um, use backdoor ways to take away our constitutional rights. And this group has um, asked credit card companies to give an MCC code specifically for people who would buy guns or ammunition. The commissioner just and sworn in last week, taking up this effort as gun licensing is under his department. Introduced by Bavard County Sheriff Wayne Ivey, two Republican legislators backing the bill flanked him. Commissioner Simpson targets an organization called the ISO. He says they're taking Floridians' freedom away when they buy firearms and ammunition. The ISO, which is the International Organization for Standardization, approved the creation of the code last year. They should not be able to identify us, which for the purposes of intimidating and bullying, bullying our citizens, and then obviously keeping lists, and then obviously putting those lists on public display. Democrats argue the practice is already done for other dangerous goods, and... If you're a responsible gun owner, you have nothing to worry about. This really is a tool for law enforcement to have if someone is making a usual purchases that could be plotting a mass shooting. The proposed legislation would impose a fine of up to $10,000 every time a credit card company assigns the code. Democrat lawmakers say it's part of a broader Republican move. Because when it comes to issues of, of gun access, Republicans are often competing for who will loosen the most gun laws. The commissioner says the bill will be filed in the coming weeks. He's hoping to get action on it in this session. In Titusville, Scott Heidler, West 2 News.